How to Velocity Edit CapCut PC Editing velocity in CapCut lets you adjust video speed for creative effects. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you how to get that done. Alright, here is how we are going to do it. First things first, let's go ahead and add our video. From this point forward, I'm going to go ahead and extract the audio because we're going to do this one in order for us to be able to better see the audio. Now we're going to lower the level of it as well. And I'm doing this one partly because we want to avoid copyright. Now I'm going to go to the part where I want to start. So it should be around here. All right, there you go. So I'm going to start here. Now I'm just going to cut this one or split them. And I'm going to delete the first part. So now we are here. So I'm just going to go ahead and start. Now from this point forward, what I want to do is basically look for the part where I want to put the velocity edit. So for example, I want to go ahead and put it from here. There you go. So there. All right. So I'm just going to go ahead and basically cut this one. There you go. Now we have cut it. All right. So after cutting this part here, we're going to go ahead and proceed to the part where we want to continue. All right, this time I'm going to go ahead and split this one as well as the audio. And I'm going to go ahead and stop here. I'm going to cut this one here, right here. I'm going to delete it. And I want this one to move right here, but I can't do that manually. So I'll have to click this one. And then we're going to go ahead and click the speed. Now we're going to adjust this one. So we want to be able to have this one move in here. So we're going to do that by manually adjusting it. All right, there you go. And then we're just going to go ahead and cut this one. And now we are here. All right, so let's try playing it. All right, and then we're going to go ahead and cut this part as well. So this one, this one, and then we're going to cut the beginning. So we want to be able to begin around here. Cut this, cut this, and then still the same thing. Go ahead and click speed. And let's see. All right, there you go. All right, so now we have cut this one. Now, one thing that we can do in order to add some effects in here is basically go ahead and click the library. Now here in the library, you're going to go ahead and look for white. You just basically look for anything white. It could be a picture. Uh, I think this is a picture, so I'm going to click this one and I'm going to go ahead and add it here. Now we're going to go ahead and cut this just like so. And uh, from this point forward, we're going to make this as big as we can or to, to fit basically the entire thing. And we're going to go ahead and blend this one as overlay. All right, there you go. Now go ahead and look for um, animation and then out. And then we're going to add a fade out. So we're going to go ahead and look for fade out. All right, there we go. I'm going to just go ahead and click this one. So it'll be like this. There you go. So that's pretty amazing, right? So you can click this one and then you can put this wherever you want in the project. So we're going to do that one more later on. But this time, I'm just going to go ahead and continue and basically repeat the same process as we had earlier. All right, this part right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, cut this one. Just a moment. All right. All right, cut this. Cut this one as well, and then click this, click the speed, and then you are seeing something like this. So you can just go ahead and drag this one just like so. All right, so here's what we got right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and just copy this one and then put this where we want to. So say, for example, I'm going to put it here as well. Let's make it a bit longer. All right, so I guess we are done this time. Let's go ahead and check this out. So basically, velocity is all about changing the speed and then basically putting some sort of effects in it. But here is what I got. So I'm just going to go ahead and play this for you guys. All right, just like that. 
So yep, that's basically how you're going to do it. This is actually a very simple process. Um, you can also find some templates on this one, but if you want to do it in a PC, then this is the easiest way. So yep, congratulations everybody. That is how you are going to edit velocity here in CapCat PC. And as always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if it helps you out.